Hello, Mark. I'm afraid I've got bad news. Hank passed last night. He was really fighting, but just couldn't hold on. I called twice this morning, but it went right to voicemail. I know you've got that interview, but the funeral is this Saturday. I'm sorry you couldn't get to see him. He was asking for you. He loved you like he loved his own children. The other day I came across that picture of you two at Hannah's wedding at the farmhouse. You know the one where you called Hank old man right before I took the picture? <laughs> it always made me laugh. We spent 40 years at that house. I never thought we'd live there that long. Oh, here I am, rambling like always. I just called to tell you the news. I can understand if you can't come on Saturday. Jen is going to be there, of course. You know, she dyed her hair again a few weeks ago. It looks nice. I just... I can't stand to think of you two living by yourselves in the same city. Would you come, Mark? Just talk to her for a little bit. If not for her, then for me. Just to say hello and honor Hank. I'm not mad at you, Mark. Hank wasn't either. I'd just like to see you. And if you don't come now, I'm afraid I'll never get to see you again. Well, that's enough from me. I hope to talk to you soon. And whether you come or not, know you'll always have my love.